Assalamu alaikum. Bitches, how y'all doing today? Hey, sometimes I'm walking around. I don't wear a belt. I think men should wear belts, but sometimes I like to wear shorts. You don't show off my sexy legs and also show support to my favorite baseball team. Y'all did great, Phillies. Great season. Came up short, but we're proud of you. So how the hell am I going to carry concealed with a waistband like that, man? Shorts and a t-shirt? I don't know. How are you going to do it? All right, let's see how this looks. Okay. And I'll carry a full-size revolver. This is a K-Frame Model 66. And I got this damn belly band on. All right, it's elastic. The jury's still out on whether I really like it, but... You know, you can put a full-size gun in there. It's slim. I even got a speed loader pouch, okay, or magazine. All right. Man, it's shooting and moving, not doing so good. Let's try that again. All right. All right, this reload pouch, I got to clear the cover garment again. Fish for it, fish for it, okay. Got it. All right, that's one thing that I have a problem with with this 66 is that I got sticky damn chambers. There's times I'm doing a reload and that shit just will not stay put. So. Let me pause this and find this round that just fell. Sorry guys, my camera's acting all screwy. I had to find these rounds that fell on the ground. Okay, so we'll do a loose reload on that. So anyway, back to the belly band. So I'm pretty sure these were these were created for, you know, your your pretty common subcompact revolvers and you know pistols and shit. Alright, but it'll fit the 66 with no problem. So, I mean, it's, you know, it's got Velcro and may or may not have the body type for that kind of thing, but um, it's an interesting concept if you're if you're into wearing shorts and a t-shirt. Okay, here we go, I'm gonna finish these rounds off and do a, a reload. All right, now, this is how you would have to reload with loose ammo, man. It doesn't work too good. it that's hot as shit but that's how you do it gotta practice see you guys later but yeah a lot of times you know i'm out here working shorts just feel better you know pt shorts gym shorts whatever man t-shirt it's hot as fuck today i don't really want to wear a belt all right sweatpants whatever okay so there may be times that you're wearing this kind of stuff um you know, you got you got to account for if you're going to carry a gun in this kind of manner. All right, this is a belly band. This is tight to the body. I'm able to squeeze the revolver into this thing. I couldn't tell you the freaking manufacturer on this. I just know it's a belly, it's a belly band. It has a Velcro strap to it. Straps up on your side. You've got a pouch in the front. You can put your put your ma extra mag. In my case, a speed loader. You can put a flashlight anything like that okay it comes in and out pretty easily um but uh i imagine you know just like a pussy the more it gets used the more loose it gets man so that's something we got to be aware of so look at that it goes in it's tight i got it in there okay doing some exercises all right you know, it seems to work all right. But uh, if I had to do a one-handed reload, we got to be careful with that too because usually you're putting that in your waistband. So let's say my weak hand has been shot. I'm going to do a strong side only reload, okay? So I cannot use my weak hand. All right. Usually you put that in your waistband. So in this case, you can't do that. This barrel's hot as shit. I'm going to have to put it inside of the holster which is going to be difficult to do right when i grab my reload this is hot as fuck <coughs> that's how 
how you're gonna do it. Just like that. Okay, we gotta be able to access our weapon right and left hand, no matter where we're at, what we're carrying. So I'll try that with the belly band real quick. See how it works here. Strong hand is out of the game. Actually works a lot easier because it's so elastic. I can I can get to that weapon without any restriction. Careful with your finger as you draw. All right, and we're gonna try and get a grip in the holster so that we're not messing with the grip out here. Because if we mess with that grip at 115 beats per minute, you know we're gonna we're gonna drop that gun. Okay, we lose our fine motor skills, so they're gone. All right, so I got one shot left. Let's just see how quick I can get on target. And I might just back up for this next one. Okay, so how fast can you be compared to a traditional holster on your waistband? Let's find out. I don't have a shot timer, but you guys, you know, with the Cinemize, let's see how well we do here. Oh, man, and I missed my target, so it doesn't make any difference how fast I was because I was too high. That was a miss. All right, let's see if I have any more rounds.